It's starting the recording, so okay, we could be, we could be, in, uh, we could be having Camtasia going, I'm not really sure, you never know until it happens. So, oh, yes, okay, I'm ready. Um, so, shall we, shall we go into the school? Um, I have a question, um, are more people coming into our introduction, or, because we thought if there are several people uh, joining us, we put them into uh, a spectator's mode, so they can all just follow uh, without problems through uh, the school and have a flight around uh, this building. Uh, I really don't know. It's hard. We've mm -hmm. invited quite a lot of. I mean, we invited. You know, it, the way you throw a party is you invite everybody. So yes, of that's course. What we did. We invited as many people as we possibly could. <laughs> uh, it's a little early in the United States. Like I'm not sure where it is okay. where Jeff is. It's probably about six in the morning there. Or no, well, no, nine, nine, nine in the morning. Nine in the nine morning. Yes. Yeah, okay. Yeah, back on the on the left coast, it's probably that early in the morning. So. But okay. anyway, no, no telling, Torsten, and, and keep in mind also that I've got to actually be in another place at five, uh, sorry, at the, at the top of the hour, so mm -hmm. uh, I'd like to see as much as possible while we're here. Hey, so, strange question though, but was the server address ever shared? <laughs> yeah, um, it was. I don't, it, okay, do, do you, I don't recall did you, catching it. Okay, it's in the event. Uh, the event that's set for the meeting, if you click read all, then you should see uh, the server information is there. Um, ah, Kathleen is here. Are they all individual images? That means, um, well, we have don't have a PowerPoint uh, like that. So Maybe we, uh, uh, can we put the server address into the? Uh, let me see if I can get it into the. Oh, oh yes, see, just I'm, uh, I'm live here. I've got mm -hmm. it. I, I just pasted it into my browser. So here, uh, there we mm -hmm. go. Yeah, I, I just put it into Minecraft. So this is the address. And if you can copy that, you can get to the uh, get to the Minecraft yeah. server. And I want to yes. say hi to Kathleen, who's one of our um, our Minecraft participants. I can't see the participants list very well here. Okay. I'm not sure how to see if I can... Oh, the... I guess um, as, as you get better at this, Jeff, you need to... There's something you can set that will give us rights to manipulate the pods, the chat pod, you can just... Do you mean make a presenter? Um, well, you could, I'm just scrolling down to just see who's here. We've got Tabish, Maxim, oh, these are your students, right? Yes, these are the students. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and I'm getting a, a little bit of an echo. Yes, it feels like being in that rotunda, you know. Kathleen, you should be. Did, are you having a problem? Okay, well maybe Torsten can whitelist you. Yes, uh, Florian is already uh, typing something. Can you please give us your um, Minecraft name? Uh, and he, he turned off the whitelist so everybody can enter. Uh. <laughs> okay. Now, uh, can we also do something about the sound? Because if you're not wearing a headset, you need to mute your mic when you're not talking. Somebody's speakers are feeding back into their, uh, yeah, now it stops. Okay, I think it's okay now. Yeah, so either put on a headset or be very careful about muting your uh, microphone when you're not talking. Yeah, I'm hearing myself twice, and we're recording ourselves twice as well. With a lag. <laughs> okay. Okay, the next picture, I hope you see it. 
yes, is uh, showing mm -hmm. our event. This was uh, during the bar camp when we had this LAN party and the students connected to um, this Minecraft server that was held by Maxime in the beginning. And I will just show you one or two pictures of the beginning, how it was designed. And here you see uh, they all logged in and tried to um, yeah, work together and build up the school. I take another picture. So this got started when you went to a bar camp and yes. uh, you got the idea to build redesign your school without that annoying rotunda in the middle yes the uh, funny started, thing was that we would we would uh, blast it with uh, dynamite so that was the funny um, aspect for the students but before doing that they had to construct it so uh -huh. this is uh, a picture of the first uh, minutes when they started um, uh, to construct the uh, the basic walls and you see that yellow thing in the background, so that is the uh, rotunda that uh, was to be built first uh -huh. and then destroyed. Mm -hmm. So, nice to see the build from the very beginning. Oh yes, that's why I show you this, because it gives you a better impression of uh, what the students did, in fact. Yeah. This I is one step further. Just to let people see in Minecraft, I've got Minecraft here as well, but we're looking, uh, I, in my Minecraft, I'm going to the, the one I'm camp doing a recording of, this is the buildings that they were building, I've just gone over there, so I'll go back to your uh, presentation. Okay, there's, there's the rotunda going up in the middle. This is it, and you see there's a Minecraft uh, figure having dynamite in the hand. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so that was one funny aspect that they filled up the rotunda with explosives and then just blasted it. Kathleen says she's still access denied on the server. Oh, I'm sorry. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, Florian is taking care of her. Okay. Okay, they're 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 working that out. Or is that you? Okay. Are you Florian? In uh, are you the same? You don't know what people's uh Okay. Florian is uh, not the same of course. Because in you could be one thing in Adobe and another thing in Minecraft and another thing in real life, so I <laughs> don't really know exactly who the people are. <laughs> Anyhow, okay, so while you're doing that, I'm going to wander around. The, maybe I'll just fly overhead. I think I'll do that. We can. Are we prevented from flying? I, this is possible, but uh, as I said, we wanted to put you into the spectator's mode because there everybody mm -hmm. can fly without mm -hmm. um, being able to destroy something. And then uh -huh. um, after that fir oh, first presentation, we, yeah. we um, will have a look at the building as it uh, was finished. And then I think it's a bit better to understand. Uh -huh. Okay. Well, I'm flying around now. Just uh, while you're... Uh, while you're helping uh, Kathleen, uh, I'm just giving people something to look at in my recording. <laughs> and, and sort of talk to them, keep the chatter going. But anyway, I'm just looking overhead. I'm up on the roof of the Ricarda Hochschule now. Mm -hmm. uh, this is where uh, everybody, where you, you built the rotunda, won't be inside because you've destroyed it. It is there, uh, but yeah. we, we see it later. Um, no, if you okay. have a look at uh, Adobe Connect, then you see that picture when uh, it was blown up. Uh, yeah. Okay, so it was really um, 
important to have this moment because during our bar camp it took a long time to build up the school or at least the basic walls and uh, but we, as you see I saw on the picture it was late in the evening but the students said we want to finish this we want to have this moment when we explo uh, blast it off yes and so it was a kind of motivation for them otherwise maybe they would have stopped playing before Mm -hmm. And uh, to be able to do this, I uh, one moment. I gave them this um, plan of the school. the ground plot yes yes uh -huh. yep and with that ground plot they uh, started to uh, have the basic shape of the school itself so that was my input if you want to so to speak and uh, with this they uh, just started and had fun in the LAN party together uh, you say it took them a long time to build it uh, how long yes. did it take them well, we started in the afternoon and it was like uh, three or four hours to um, to have the basic walls and the rotunda because they had to organize themselves. It's easy if you, if you construct something alone because it's just you, but if you're working together, they said, okay, one is building the rooms in the background, one is building the... Um, um, contract of um, administration in the foreground with the atrium and the teacher's room. So uh, they had to organize it and keep in inside this map because otherwise they would have built something and had to, to destroy it afterwards for nothing. So I had several plans of uh, the um, basic lines of the uh, ground plots and I gave every student one of them and they just discussed how long is this wall, how long is this wall. That was what they had to figure out themselves. Yeah, uh, they're just uh, high, uh, high school students, Hochschule students? Um, yes, we have a gymnasium in Germany. This is uh, like a high school I think in, uh, in the mm -hmm. States. Yes. Uh -huh. Okay, uh, I get a message from Maxime. We should be able to fly in spectator mode now. So, now, as you have seen in the beginning of our event, of our bar camp, we have a, we have a look at the school itself. Is uh, Okay, I'm standing at the beacon, but I'm alone here, I think. Okay, I'll see if I can get back there. All right, there you are. Onik is there. Onik is Maxim. Yeah. Ah, okay. And I see some cubes. Zoom. Okay, I'm uh, Maxim, can you hear me? You have to activate your um, microphone. Adobe Connect, and then we can start with uh, the tour. Yes, hello, Maxime. Well, I'm here. Who else is on the server? Maybe we should all meet at the beacon. Ah, here they come. Okay. I see the chat.
Jeffers here. He's a rhino zoo. Oh, okay. It's not so easy to identify the people by their nicknames. No. <laughs> I'm teacher Vance. It's pretty easy. Yeah, yeah. Okay, Maxime, I don't know where uh, Florian or Tabish is. And Susani is also here. Susani, I believe, is Beth. No, is it Beth? Let me think. We just had... Oh, Susani is Kathleen, yes. Oh, I see. So then she's... She's made it at the beginning. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So, we just follow Maxime. Maxime, where are you? Okay. <laughs> okay.
Yes, I agree. Um, if you see the picture of uh, our school that Maxime just uploaded, um, it's not brand new because uh, the whole roof is now covered with solar panels and uh, that's a very uh, interesting thing that our school is changing from year to year and so we have uh, new inputs to uh, change also the Minecraft school just to keep it up to date. Are you planning to become architects? <laughs> Good question. <laughs> it looks like you could be. Mercea has just joined us. Uh, you probably, maybe you've met Mercea at the EVO server. He's a master builder. We've just been riding his roller coaster in the server party okay. we just had. We're having a lot of fun over there. You can come back and join us there at some point. We'll get Mercedes to show us around his builds as well. They're quite whimsical. Interesting. Do you want to explain the purpose of the redstone blocks for people who might be listening later? Halfway through the hour, so just be minding of the time because Mariana and I are going to have to go and meet some other people at, on the top of the hour. Great. Um, can Hello, Tavish. Yes. I hear you. Mm -hmm. 
Right, I see most of us are there. like I'm a student here. <laughs> important information for students. I'm a little lost because I, I was looking the wrong way. Uh, where am I now? Yeah. Let's see. Um, I'm at uh, Linux Herr Gross office. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> oh, here uh, we are. I, I see I you now. Okay. Yeah. I found you. Yeah. Um, here's the left side. Um, here's the Aspen wing. The, um, our higher teachers, like uh, our, like, um, Funny to see you all virtual around my office. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I guess every time you add some furniture there, you have to put it here in Minecraft as well. Yes, uh, I'm about to. <laughs> needs a roller coaster. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just thinking of Mircea. He's good at building those kinds of things. I see. Well, but yeah, you see the school is quite big and uh, there are long ways to go. Huh? That's an impression you already get in Minecraft.
Okay. So we're back where the columns are. Mm -hmm. Is this the lighting you were talking about? Yes, on the floor here, yeah. Uh-huh, okay. Do you have something similar at your school? Uh, you no, we have lights in the ceiling, of course, yeah. Uh-huh. up the stairs. Do you have such a painting at your school? Uh, yes, we have paintings at uh, the walls in our school, made by students. Mm -hmm. uh, not this one, of course, mm -hmm. but um, similar mm -hmm. ones. <laughs> yeah, the right side are the computer rooms. On the side, once you see the lockers where students put ah, their things mm -hmm. in mm -hmm. lockers. In case they die and have to respawn. you see the lights as they are in the reality. Mm, okay, yes. Mm. Ah, mm -hmm. 
special subjects like journal English, math, and for special subjects like physics or chemistry, you need the special floor on the at the beginning where we have entered. There are not only the uh, headquarters office or teachers office. There are the special rooms for special. Library? to the roof. Yes, that's it. Kathleen, you can just look up and press the W key, and that should get you up the stairs. Jeff broke a door already. <laughs> ah, Marianne is asking me if I sent her my PowerPoint. I actually, I put it, I uploaded it to the room. But I haven't sent it anywhere. It only took a few minutes to get uh, a minute to get it up. So the answer to that is no. I didn't send the PowerPoint. No, but she's asking me. Uh, she can't hear me. She's not, li for some reason, not listening. There we go. <laughs>
Okay, so that's downstairs. Yes. Downstairs to the ground floor. are lost. Oh, here, we're back in the columns. I am, anyway. Oh, we say it's back here in the columns. We look like we might be in a lunchroom. I think we're in a cafe, the canteen, maybe? Oh, then here you we went go. outside? Yes. Oh. No, no. Outside, I'm not sure. I see you now, though. Is it, oh, this is the road. This is the famous rotunda. Is yes. it, it's still, or you, you built it anyway. <laughs> Um, we didn't destroy it. Uh, well, they destroyed it in the in the party in the bar camp, but uh, um, mm -hmm. in reality, it's still there. Uh, but it's here, right here, in the in the build. Yes, inside the building. Mm -hmm. It's like the heart of our school. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> or the egg of your school, is it maybe? Uh, as you see it, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> So are the are, are people at the school getting any ideas about design from what you how you've reshaped interiors and things like that? There were discussions about it, but um, there was not like uh, a competition in art, which would have been possible. Um, this didn't take place. Uh, but we there was one point uh, when this big hall was uh, renovated. Uh, where they really dis uh, discussed should we destroy the egg and uh, finally they said no we don't do it because inside this egg and right in front there are a lot of presentations and we have a big English drama group um, they are making their theatre acts there and uh, they said this is so perfect to do it so we want to keep it okay <laughs> okay Send me an email so I can explain my uh, how I kind of let things stop now. But this looks like uh, the cliffs of mohair. Is that what it's called in Ireland? <laughs> <laughs> uh, 
Where Led Zeppelin has a an album cover. This kind of structure. I see. Hmm. I'm having trouble getting up the stairs. Why am I? I'm trying to fly. No, oh, I think we're in survival mode or so. Hmm. So you have to jump. Ah, how do you do that? Uh, pressing space and W. Pressing space. Ah, yeah. Okay. Oh, that's that. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm learning as we go. <laughs> <laughs> So what did I learn from this tour? I learned how to jump. <laughs> I probably knew that at one time, I just hadn't used it in such a long time. Ah. You have to play the uh, playing football. And here's a picture of the basketball. Sauna here? Uh, not yet. <laughs> oh. I was wondering what was in that building. It looked like it could be a sauna. No, it's for tool, uh, toys uh, for kids to play like football and so. Oh. Uh, mm -hmm. Okay. A storeroom. He has a storeroom for footballs and so. Uh-huh. Vance, how are we in the time? Yep. Um, I probably need to be going in the next few minutes because, um, I mean, I suppose people are flexible. Um, mm -hmm. You don't really have to start right on time. You're not renting a building or anything like that. But they're supposed um, to start on the hour, the top of the hour. I see. I said the, uh, the, the PowerPoint. Okay. Is uh, Florian telling us anything? I see he has a microphone problem, okay. So when I see um ah. yeah. Hey, what a lovely tour. Very nice. Yes, oh, and uh, I must say, mm -hmm. yeah, and I thank you uh, guys very much, uh, Florian and Maxim and uh, Tabish, for to be our guides and uh, show us around in, in the school. 
And I must say I'm very happy that we have something constructed in 2012 or be beginning in 2012. It took about a year to finish the school uh, that we are showing now in 2016 um, to another group. I think that's a real success. Yeah, and, the, and these are the builders, uh, Maxime and uh, Florian and... Who, yes, who these the three were the main builders. We, there were, uh, yeah, how many yeah. students have been uh, working there together? Um, Maxime, can you tell us? Do you have something like a screenshot from Mahara that we were using? Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, Kathleen also learned how to jump. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> well, I guess we're going to have to go in about a minute. Because mm. um, it'll take me a little, little time to transition. Of course, yeah. I've got to go into Blackboard Collaborate, and uh, it's not a formal presentation. I'm just explaining. I'm explaining learning together. LearningTogether.net. Yes. That's uh, one of my projects. Mm -hmm. Explaining That's how it incorporates blogs and wikis. But anyway, yes, yes. Go ahead. Yes, well, as Maxine said, about 16 students work there and uh, I think this is um, one of the biggest success that uh, this project was uh, held by students alone. There was no teacher guiding them, uh, apart from the initiation, of course, but they, they did it in their spare time, they did it together, they uh, worked in groups, they organized themselves and uh, this, I must say, must uh, has made me really proud that uh, yeah, this is what we try to teach them, yes? Organize themselves and, and work in cooperation to do something constructive. Yeah, that's that's really great. That's the message we're all uh, getting and projecting through Minecraft, that it's, uh, it's just a remarkable environment. You can see how, what people are learning about maths and dimension and... Um, you know, well, anyway, it's it's quite obvious that there's quite a lot. And, of course, we're learning in our uh, project, our venture here, the teachers, we're learning mm -hmm. what gamification feels like and how, uh, how we can cooperate and do things that we want to do and apply these principles to our own classrooms and students. So that's our reason for being here. Anyway, it's, yes? Oh, okay, let's see. Uh, Mariana has a message for me here. She says she's in Blackboard Collaborate and they're waiting for me. Mm, okay, so yes. I'm going to have to pack up my Camtasia. And um, thank you very much. Thank this you. This is Torsten Gross. And yes. Yeah, so yeah, very nice to meet you here. It was a lovely tour. Yes, thank you, Vance. It was very nice to, to guide you through our project. And, uh, yeah, we I will stay here a little longer, so if anybody has a question, I'll be here for a minute. And um, to you, um, a lot of success in the next uh, scene. Yeah, no problem there. Okay, well, Camtasia is saying goodbye, and uh, thanks again for the tour. Yes, bye-bye. Bye-bye. Everyone else can stay. I've just got to run off. <laughs>